Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here. And we are back in Witch Hunt. Alright, guys. Well, we killed the tree in the last episode. And now we gotta go on to the witch, but different things have happened. So, we saw the little black goat in the town. There was the sleeping guy from the church dead in the little barn shack up there so I am looking around double checking things here in town to see what has changed what hasn't changed we can't jump this oh we can haha -ha, we got it hello cows the barn is open again Okay, healing plant. There's nothing new in the chest. Okay. Oh, what is this? Nothing? Oh, it's the lock from the chest. Oh, okay. I gotcha, I gotcha. Alright. The witch person hanging is still gone nothing in there nothing going on at this house healing plants still see I don't know why there's healing plants in the town if you can just go to the dude and get healed there's that horse Here's the trader. Uh, we got 62. And eh, we still got bullets, so I'm not really worried about it. Um, we only have one crucifix, though. That's the problem I'm foreseeing right now. Is that we're going to get over there and start fighting and attacking the dude. Or the witch, whatever you want to call it. And we're going to not have the backup of the crucifixes because we only have one. Let's go see the mayor. Knock, knock. Legends will be made about your fight with that horrible creature. Yes, they will. Is that all you got to say? You're not going to give me no money, no bullets, no nothing? Why do I work for you again, old man? Alright, let's come over here and check out the creepy house. See if anything has changed here. Still locked, still boarded. Still got the weird dirty spot on the ceiling. Oops. Okay. So, nothing really changed in here. Alright. Still got that blue chest in there. I want to get to that. Urgh. Okay. So... Bird. Oh, the body's gone. It's odd. Hold on. Let me check this house over here. No, just a... See? The big... O Ooh, spider. Ooh, kill it. Haha, -ha, we killed the spider. What inside this? Oh, can we open it now? Oh, we don't have a code. Look at all the little bugs. Hmm, okay. 
nothing around back really. Porta potty still locked. Okay. All right. Well, I guess let's get back into it, and we'll see what's going on. So we've checked the entire town. And there wasn't really anything different other than that one body appeared, the building had opened, the barn reopened, and the mayor had something different to say this time. So, what I think... What I think needs to happen is that every time we get up to a new boss... A little bit harder. And we need to utilize our crucifixes a little bit more. So I need to kill some dudes. Let's go this way. So I'm not really wanting to go directly after the witch. I mean, if we come across her, yeah, I'll fight her. Because I don't know if she's going to be, like, hunting us like she was in her other little form. Her little invisible ghosty form. So, I don't know. Like I said, I will shoot her, though. I will shoot her in her witchy face. And they will sing songs about the musket ball that hit her in her nose. Okay, so we can either go to the left or to the right. Let's go to the left. Why not? I guess this is the way I want to go. I don't know. I'm trying to see if there's anything new in the map that we haven't really come across. I'm sure there is. I'm sure there are things that we have just missed that I don't know where they are. And That's the... That's the problem with this game. Is that... You just kind of got to wander around, stumble... And to me, you kind of get, once you start realizing where things are, you kind of follow a set path every time. And I think it's those set paths that are keeping me from finding new things. Like I know if I want to find, originally if I wanted to find stuff, you go up on top of the hill. That's where we find the cauldron and, you know, all kinds of other little things, but... I don't know, let's keep going this way for right now. Alright, so we're all the way down here. Maybe we can bounce from hillside to hillside? Or probably not, since the Whispers want to play. I heard it. Yeah. 
I right, you vile dirtiness. Show yourself. There you are. Ah, <laughs> get wrecked. get our money and our free totems we'll make sure of that one okay so this really isn't a hill but let's go up here I don't know if we've really searched up here real well Especially in some of this thicker stuff. Like the thicker and nastier it looks, I think we've kind of avoided it. Okay, we're coming up the hill. Have we... Oh, we haven't been down there. Hold up. We gotta go check this out. I saw something. I saw something. What did we find? <laughs> Urgh, I hate that little dude. He's so skittish. We got a save point. Can we crouch? Yes. Okay, can I have... Yeah, I got room for it. Yay, lockpicks. Even though I'm not sure why we need more lockpicks, but... We have... Nine lockpicks and 48 bullets. Cool. So, we found a new little spot up here. And... I say we keep going around and we keep looking and... I'm not going to mess around with the water down here. Let's try to get back up on the hill. Will it let us or are we going to have to... Uh oh. Seriously? We seriously got stuck right here. Can we crouch? Oh, we can crouch. Okay, good. Alright guys, well, there you go. If you get stuck, try to crouch. Got the witchy close. <laughs> yeah, not exactly what I was aiming for, but you know. It is what it is, and we just saved, so if we get wrecked by the witch. Then we get wrecked by the witch. I wonder. Yeah, she's just kind of roaming around. Through the forest. Didn't really see anything to dictate one way versus the other, so. Old fallen tree. Um. Is 
See, it makes me wonder, that big old tree over there, I don't think I can get... Okay, she moved away from us. You know, we've never really ex explored over here. Let's go over here and look. Yeah, let's get all the way down here by the water. Okay, I already know that's too steep for me to climb. Where are we at? Yeah, we're right on that rim. Right on that edge. Should have hit him. Start using the musket. Iron sights on it are better. We have no sights here. What is that? I see you right there. Alright. Heading in that direction. Um, something just kind of screeched at me a little bit. Okay, we got a new little area here. Actually, kind of got me there. <laughs> that one got me a little bit. Something attacked me from behind. No, no. Okay, we gotta try again. Ha! That was good. That was good. Oh, I didn't see the second one or the third one. All right, so we need to come over here. Crouch down. Get the bullets, get the lock picks. Okay, come out. Just in case I want a little skeleton dudes over here again. No. Okay. <laughs> All right, so we had went all the way down there. We didn't find anything. I'll go ahead and take that. Oh, no, we need to come up over the top of this hill. Okay. Yep, yep. Now I remember where we were. Go ahead and run up the hill. Come on. Really? Good thing I figured out that crouch technique. Alright. So, we're over here. Now we gotta keep going. Until we get to this side. There it is over there. OK, 
got the little screechy. Dead chick. Burned at the cross. <laughs> that all y'all gonna bring this time? Just one? What is this? <laughs> go this way now. Is that okay with everyone? Sheesh. Let me be, Whispers. I'm looking at a giant bell. Okay, well. That's a thing, I guess. I mean, I don't know it. I wanted to come back over here because this is where we heard that screech come from. Oh, we got a cave. Oh, spider. No! F, F. Yes, eat that. Okay. Ha ha! Spider cave. What do we got here? Take and read. Safe code 0451. Nice. Bullets and some more lock picks. Nice. 0451. That is awesome. How much money do we got? 76? That's not very much. Alright, well, I'm glad we went back. Because now we got the safe code and we can crack the safe. Maybe, hopefully, we'll find us some goodies. I'm going to keep exploring. Every time. They're trying to kill me. I want to go that way, Whispers. Oh, they're on both sides of me. Okay, where are we at? Right here at the bend. I am going to see what's up here. Climb to the top of this. Probably not. Maybe. Who are again? Oh. Is it up there? 
Yeah, I better not mess with it. Alright, I say we go back to town and we open up the safe. So we got some stuff done. We need to get a save in, so let's go ahead and just book it on back. Yeah, we're going the right way. Yay. Oh, I see you right there. <laughs> Alright, so let's go heal. Now let's open up the safe. Alright, let's see what's in it. Ooh, a book. New skill acquired, fast travel. Gives the ability to fast travel to town if you have at least 100 health. Consumes 100 mana. Alright. So. Is it... A super awesome skill? No, not really. I mean, we gotta have full health and we gotta have full mana. But... It is another skill. Let's go check at the mayor's office. See if he got any money for us. He should. I think we killed a few things. Good work. 80? That's it? 80? Boy, if I could pull my weapons, I would shoot you. So, we have 156 coins. Not a whole lot, but let's see what we actually have left to buy. We can get bullets, crucifixes, watcher totems. We have the Power of Nature book, which gives us 40 points of healing for the health plants. And the Second Chance book, which does the random teleport. And we have a free crucifix. Give me that. Okay, so now I have two crucifixes. Yay, we can crucifix something. Um, we have 51 bullets. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do the healing thing. Get it done. Now we only have the second chance book, and I need 60 coins to get it. And then we should have all of our powers. Yeah, this is... This is all that there is. So we'll be like the super duper dude. Uh... Okay. Alright. Well. Like I said. We need to kill a few more dudes. Get some more gold. Buy that last thing, get our dude like completely maxed out, super strong. That way we can find the witch and take her out and all that kind of good stuff. But anyway, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. I do hope everybody has enjoyed it. If you have, guys, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. It's an awesome, awesome, awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself, guys. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. 
And guys, just like to stop, take a moment to thank each and every one of y'all for all of your wonderful, awesome support, all the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared, guys. It is awesome. I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving.